What is up, foreigners, and welcome back to 2v2s Until We Lose, Season 4, Episode 2. High Flying and Boss Boy are currently 4 0 in this season. They started out extremely hot in the first four games. So let's continue this streak and tell them to battle. If you haven't seen the first episode, you can go back and watch that. Other than that, you're all caught up on 2v2s Until We Lose. All right, let's jump into this first battle. Matched up against Simba and Gush 2129. They're a level 13. We're a level 12 crown tower. This is going to be an intense battle. Dark Prince in the back of the tower to kick things off. Fire Spirit jumping into that right princess tower. And there goes the level 13 Royal Giant raged up with the bats. Nice fireball right on the knight and the bandit. Boom! Early tower. After they first push, and they're trying to keep their towers alive with this Mega Knight. And the bats will be able to stop it. Insane push for High Flying and Boss Boy. Here in Battle 1. And Gush is already leaking. I think he's given up. And they send over a Goblin Barrel. Instant log. Great counter. And now Simba, he's leaking elixir too. This will hurt them later in the battle as High Flying and Boss Boy have been more efficient with their elixir. All right, Double Dark Prince charged up. Making their way across the field with the Skarmie and Balloon. Fire Spirit in the mix. And the Mini Pekka all raged up. Yep, they've given up. Game over. Easy three crown in the first battle here. Boom, boom, boom. High Flying and Boss Boy taking that one easily, making Simba and Gush uh, rage quit. That's what we like to see early in this episode. All right, moving on to the next battle. Hackery and Cameron from Hashtag 420 Clan are matched up against High Flying and Boss Boy. And we're starting things off with the Royal Giant again. He gets two decent hits before he's taken out. And they have the Dark Witch Executioner and... Uh, Prince trying to make it their way to our tower. The Skarmy won't cut it for defense as the Executioner destroys it. But the Dark Prince back in play. Nice zap on the Mini Pekka. Stopping his hit to take out the Dark Prince. And the Dark Prince is able to take out the Executioner. All right, we're letting the Elixir recharge for the next push. Let's see who's going to make the first move. All right, Hackery sending in the P.E.K.K.A. at the back of the tower. They're going to try to turn this into a push. They have the Mega Minion to back it up. Fireball on both of them, almost taking out the Mega Minion. Doing some decent damage on that Princess Tower. And they send a Fireball right back. Great arrow on the Firecracker. Now we just need to take out the baby dragon and Pekka. Now they're pushing with the dark or the yeah the dark prince and hog rider in the back. We take out the dark or the Pekka. Oh my gosh. There are so many cards on the field, and the baby dragon is absolutely demolishing our tower as it takes it out. We rage up the double dark prince, but is stopped by the Ewiz and witch. They had enough elixir to defend our small push. After a defensive play, Boss Boy and High Flying are falling behind, but they should be able to come back as we're approaching times two elixir. We have seen it before, and we send in the balloon. We'll probably be taken out. An awful fireball. All right, small push, but should be defended by the E-Wiz, and it is. And they're going to build up their iconic push with the P.E.K.K.A. But now we have the, oh, we arrowed the crown tower. But the Royal Giants raged up. He should be able to finish this. One more shot. Boom. High flying and Boss Boy tie up the game after that insane push with the Dark Prince. And they mirror the Velcro. Level 14 on the field. And fireballs are exchanged. We need to stop this push. 
We're doing a much better job. That baby dragon's almost taken out. That's what killed us the last time. Great defense for High Flying and Boss Boy after that strong push. Hog Rider back on the field, and the Skarmy takes care of that one. All right, we're tied up. Heading into overtime. Anyone's game. Oh, they send in the Golem for the first time. Let's see how High Flying and Boss Boy defend this as they fireball the left push. Almost taking all the units. Nice log. And the Golem is split in half. We need to finish it. The taking it under 1,000 HP, but we have the Royal Giant raged up on the left side, doing some massive damage. It is stopped by the P.E.K.K.A. and Mini P.E.K.K.A. combo. All right, pushing from both sides. We need to stop this P.E.K.K.A. on the right. We're going to log it. And the balloon almost made it to the tower, but we have to deal with this massive push with the Hog Rider, P.E.K.K.A., Dark Pr Witch, and Min Mega Minion. Great fire spirit and the bats defending extremely well. And they mirror the hog rider. He gets a single hit, but the E-Wiz is able to stop it. We need a insane push here as our left tower is extremely low on HP. A miracle. And that will be it. High flying and boss boy falling short in overtime. They're getting clobbered. They almost came back. But they found their match here in Season 4. Thank you all for watching, and we'll catch you all next time. Boss Boy and High Flying finishing their season out 5-1. and one. Pretty disappointing, but some great battles for sure. Thank you all for joining us. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and we'll see you all next time. On 2v2s, until we lose. Boom, boom, boom!